today I am going to eat con in like Forest Hills with Kat. We're covering it for what and why eats. Really quickly, I just want to say thanks so much to Chase Sapphire and the infatuation for having me at Eats Con. I had a blast and I'm so grateful for the experience. Now, let's check out my time at Eats Con. Come along with me. Should be a fun day and lots of food. Let's have a fun day. First stop, had to get coffee because I'm kind of tired from last night. So, I need some caffeine before I have to like, people hard and make a bunch of social content. Okay, I've never been over here before and this is absolutely adorable, look at it. Made it here, it's much warmer than I anticipated. So hoping that I can get some kind of reusable bag because like everyone has those these days. Put this jacket in, because yeah, your girl is very warm. because I was the last person that they served before they closed it out for a sapphire hour. Now, let's eat. I like bring it to my face. You're a true hero. Okay. Oh, yeah, whatever. Did I eat it all? Yes. Right now, I think I gotta give it like three and a half, three out of five, maybe. Like, it was okay. It wasn't bad. I think I was also just starving by the time I finally got food in my stomach. We are going to find something vegan for cat and do that soon. It is so much warmer here than I anticipated. Uh, so yeah, long sleeves, white rock-like top, with not the move. Sweating like a mother. All right, let's see if they got the jollof rice correct, cause I'm ready for it. Here's our jollof rice with chicken. I am ready to throw down, y'all. Ready. Rice, it's spicy. It's definitely got a nice kick to it. <laughs> You can tell the chicken was freshly grilled, which I highly appreciate. So, solid four on that. Solid four. Crab cocktail tequila distillery stop because you can tell from that. I love tequila. We are going to be able to make our own cocktails with this, which you know I love. Since this is from The Rock, we have the People's Margarita, a discus palmer. <laughs> People's Margarita. A discus margarita. We'll start with People's Margarita first. Oh, um. More limey than I was like anticipating. How's that? Better than the one I had yesterday at Rooftop Cinema. So there's that. <laughs> Hibiscus margarita. Tonight, uh, 
So this one kind of tastes like juice. I like this one more. That's not in the frame, never, but I like this one more. Naturally, I had to come to the place so I could try barbecue. We're going prime brisket. I know that that's the Eats Con exclusive, but you guys, 16 hours. 16 hours. Gotta try it. Look at these sunglasses. They're giving Angie K, and yeah, I had to get some. I got the brisket. Here we go. We're gonna try it, and I hope that it's good. One hundred percent hitting like refresh, refresh, refresh to look at the Liberty Square while we're here because yeah, gotta watch my girls and hope that they tie the series right now. This is the next stop. Okay, but like the dumplings, by the way. The dumplings are really good. The noodles were I was like, okay, like those are fine. But the dumplings, <laughs> those are fucking good. I'm home after Eats Con. I had to go walk the dog when I got home, but we're back. And I just want to say thank you to Eats Con and Infatuation for a great time. I think it's a really interesting concept. I loved seeing Girls Gotta Eat and Amari Studemeyer as somebody who does enjoy basketball. And I used to have him on my fantasy team at one point. It was really cool. And now I had some exposure to restaurants that I want to go to and check out IRL, such as Potluck. And hello, there's Starky Stark giving us some uh, some love. He has thoughts, obviously. But overall, it was a great Sunday and thanks so much. Hope that you're having a great rest of your day. If you're ever in New York, definitely go check out some of those restaurants that I went to because I am sure that what they are serving there is even more delicious than what I had at Eats Con. Bye.